So in this scenario, work with me a little bit here. We're setting up, I'm gonna show you how to dip the eye of your uh, docking lines. So take the case our model sailboat here is docked stern two. This is his stern line coming onto the dock uh, around a cleat. And he's done a, a, a bowling, which looks very nice. This is our red boat. Um, and he uh, is about to come in and he's gonna dock too. And he's gonna throw his stir li stern line uh, and he's gonna do what most people do. He's gonna take his stern line ashore and he's gonna do the whole wrap it around the cleat thing, okay? Which is what you guys all do. I know you do, because I see you in the marinas and it all looks like a big pile of mess like that. Now, this is all fine, except what happens when he wants to leave? Oh, he can't get off because your rope has jammed his on, all right? So I'm gonna show you the technique for dipping the eye. This, all this stuff on dock cleats, this is wrong. This is not what yachts do. This is not what commercial ships do. It looks like a mess. You usually end up with six feet of this laying across the dock or whatever you do, or you wrap it round and round and round. So let me show you how to dip the eye using two bowlings, and then you take up and you adjust your line on board your own boat. That way you have control of your own line. So for example, if you were coming in, let's say to a fuel dock or something, right? Well, there's usually a kid there wants to take your lines or you're coming into the marina, someone sees you coming and they're trying to be helpful to help you dock in a nice friendly way, that's great. If you just give them a bowling, you say, hey, put it on that cleat there, put it on, boom, leave it alone. They don't do anything else because you don't know if the person you just passed it to knows what they're doing. You don't know if whoever is driving your boat still needs a little room to maneuver the boat and may need you to keep this line out of the water and under control, but not made off yet. And so it gives you multiple options. You control your own rope when you put the bowling on the cleat on the dock, okay? Now, let's show you how to actually dip the eye. So the next boat, the red boat comes in, he wants to come in. This is his stern line. And being a good, considerate, seaman-like boater, he is also, prepared a bowling in his stern line. I'm not demonstrating to you how to tie this when you already know how to tie it from earlier in the video. So here is his bowling stern line ready to go. And when he comes in, watch what he does. He dips under the eye of the boat that's already there, lays his on the bollard, pulls tight, he is now docked. Watch what happens. If this guy wants to leave, he can take his line off and leave. If you want to leave, you can take your line off and leave. So that is dipping the eye. Let me show you one more time. When somebody's already there, you come in with your bowling ready-made, you come under his bowling, Drop your line on the bollard or the cleat, just like you normally would. Pull it tight, and that is dipping the eye. 